everybody, it's Adam from A New Beginning Tiny Homes. We're just going to give you a little tour of the exterior, and then we're going to move inside and give you a little tour of the inside. So, this is the exterior of the house. Now that we do have that window up there, that is a custom stained glass window that was built by me, along with this front door. This front door was also custom built by me. Not sure if you can quite see the stained glass in there yet, but we'll show it to you in just a second. So this house has the Dutch lap siding. It's got the uh, cedar shake on the uh, second level there. It is on a triple axle trailer. We do have a exterior water spout down there. This house has 18 windows in total. 17 windows were built. They're all dual pane, low E glass. They all have screens. All of the upper windows, they all do crank out and then the lower windows they are all they open up and the tops actually open down we do have a full mini split it's an LG it's a 22 and a half sear it is a 220 unit so this is a 50 amp service which you'll see right there it actually goes in and then it connects to your standard 50 amp RV plug here with your 50 with your uh, standard water connection. The roof on this is a uh, standing seam roof. It does have the tar underlayment, so this is pretty much a lifetime roof. This roof should last you a very very long time. All right, we're gonna go ahead and head inside. All right, inside we'll start at the kitchen. All right, we have full custom cabinets. They were built by me. We do have walnut butcher block countertops. This countertop that fits over the top of the stove is actually removable. You can just lift it up and there is a space for it. You can either set it over on top of the sink, it fits just right on top of the sink, or you can put it away over the top of the fridge, which is a 10.3 cubic foot fridge. It does have a freezer down below. And then of course you have lots of space inside here. Lots of my old food. <laughs> have upper cabinets with storage up above. And then we also have the uh, Tiffany stained glass lights here. So there are three windows here. They are the uh, double home. All right. All of the light switches in here are the Lutron electronic system. Um, so that means that this house is Wi-Fi capable, which means all of the light switches and lights in this house are controlled via the internet. So you can control them from an app on your smartphone or with the Amazon Alexa system, which is actually included with this house. So that makes all of the light switches in this house voice activated. So if you're in bed, you can tell the bathroom light just to go ahead and turn on and off. A lot of the sconces in here are these custom sconces from California Rustica. We do have, as we move into the main living area, this is your dining room table. It is, of course, the matching countertop from the kitchen. Now this is actually a folding leaf table, so you can actually lift it up just a little bit and it'll fold and tuck out of the way. That way you actually have a lot more space here. The furniture in here is a custom bench. It was uh, custom upholstered and then it has dual ottomans. Now one of the ottomans is out. This one here is the other ottoman. And the ottomans have folding card table legs and they fold up into this. Now what you do is you can actually take and move these over and see they're the same height 
And those can also be your seating for your dining room whenever you're done. They can just fold out of the way. And then also this piece too, this bench, is actually not fixed in there. So you can pull that out and remove that. We have lots of storage in this house. We actually have a, a custom bookcase here. And these all three drawers here you can utilize for junk. <laughs> or you can utilize them for clothes storage or whatever your preference are. We also have clothes storage underneath the stairs here. So you can store lots of stuff away. We also have a washer dryer combo that is included with the sale of this house. A folding station right up above and then there's also storage up above that for you to keep all your laundry soaps and necessities. One of the other cool features that we have is this oscillating fan. Now for those of you who want it, it is actually available at Home Depot. This is the interior mini split unit. Now this is actually a uh, AC slash heat pump. It is also Wi-Fi capable also, so you can control it from anywhere as long as you're connected to the internet. And then we do have a front sleeping loft. So this was different from the, uh, the TV show. I actually changed the railing. I was going to put a ladder in the middle, but instead decided to opt to put the ladder up the side of the fridge here and then to make the entrance to the loft over here on the side. Now you can actually see through and actually see some of the stained glass in that front window up there. That does fit a twin size bed and there is currently a twin size mattress up there. does come with a 40 inch Samsung Smart TV. Also has a Precision Temp 550 NSP on demand water heater with your dangerous gas down there with further propane. Um, this unit works extremely well and I have found that I actually have to turn it down a little bit just because it is so hot. We'll go upstairs. Go into the master loft here. You notice that we did do a barrel ceiling throughout this entire ceiling. We actually have 44 inches of clearance in the loft so you can uh, sit up in bed without any issues. We have the nice sconces there for reading lights at night if you want to read. There is also USB port connections up in the headboard just behind all the pillows there so you can charge your smartphones or whatever. Um, the cabinets that are there are actually 12 inches deep, so you can actually utilize that for a lot of storage also. And then, as we get up in here, I'm going to go ahead and sit on the bed. So you can see, we've got that beam across, and so I'm actually sitting, so you can look way down and see that there is a lot of space in here. Interior-wise, we have close to 10 foot from floor to actual ceiling on the inside. It also does have the Nest smoke and carbon monoxide tester. That is also Wi-Fi enabled too, so if it uh, ever goes off and you're not home, it will notify you. And then let's move into the bathroom. The bathroom is a uh, tumbled Amalfi marble shower. It's been done. Subway. We also did the hexagonal marbles on the floor. I use a Spectralock Pro epoxy grout, so this shower should never mold or mildew. And also through the process of that seals the marbles, so the marble should never stain. Um, this tub was custom built by me. Um, it is reclaimed cedar and it is actually fairly light. Um, it is removable, so I'm going to show you. You can actually pick it up. I'm picking it up one-handed here, and you can pull it out. So I'm not going to pull it out completely because I need to finish showing you <laughs> the rest of the house. It does have a Nature's Head composting toilet. 
plumbed out through the back. Of course, your vent. And then on this side, we do have a very tall, it's what I intended as closet storage. So we've got a lot of storage in here. BB 8's currently residing in there. And you also have additional storage for towels up above. And then on this side, we do have the custom bath vanity. There's lots of storage below. There's also lots of storage in the steps below there. And then mirror is still being done. So. And then we also, of course, have the beautiful lights in here also. And then the bathroom door is also matching to that front door. So it has stained glass in it also. Now this model is currently for sale. I have it listed at 72,000. Comes with everything that you see. If you want to, you can contact me at a new beginning tiny homes at gmail.com or feel free to find me on Facebook at a new beginning tiny homes or you can follow me on Instagram at new beginning tiny homes minus the A and uh, feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions, comments, or concerns and I'd be more than happy to talk to you about it.